Yes. <laughs> We're here with Sweet Fruitness. And I just squeezed a magical pimple out there. She just got like the ultimate release. How does it feel, baby? It hurts. The Goose Frugalité in Thailand. And uh, we just had a uh, Paul Vegan that arrived here. Paul likes pasta on YouTube. And um, you couldn't find a place to stay. His flight was delayed and it's like 12 o'clock now. <laughs> in the night. Yeah, I'm, I'm charging him charging $100 a night to have like five star luxury camping here in the refugee camp. Fucking four hours delayed flight. <laughs> Holy bro, we're building community. You can't say we're not building community, man. Cuckoo. Cuckoo. You've been getting a bit fat, baby. Yeah, I know. Too much rice, too much sugar, too much fruit. <laughs> what the fuck, dude? This is my house. If you don't like it, you can leave. Okay, you've got a point. You having fun, eh, baby? <laughs> having a broom orgasm. So, angry vegan, bro. Yeah, yeah it's been a been a while, man. It's good to see you again. And uh, thanks for shaving my legs. I appreciate it. Sure, so, um, yeah, I just want to ask you, like, what your motives were to come to Thailand? Because I heard rumors that there was like a very abusive relationship going on with Holly, aka Durian Rider, back in uh, Adelaide. Can you tell us a bit more about that? Especially like with this latest video with the laptop being smashed. I think that was like the final straw. I mean, you know, he has his moments where he just has a big temper, but he can be really gentle and, you know, really caring at certain times. Yeah. Like just gentle at the right moments. He doesn't push in too, too hard. And then what about his other side? Oh, well, you know, he, he broke my laptop, but I think he, he did it out of love. How does that work? Um, how was that? How was that the loving thing to do? I I don't know. I think he he just had to show me that he could do it. You know. Yeah. So that like there was a there was a boundary. Like you know, if you cross that line, then shit's gonna go down. You know. Yeah. So he had to kind I, of I, like. I, you know, I feel like I must have deserved it because because uh, he did it. Yeah. So then why did you come here? What 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 was the motive for coming here? Well, he shaved my hair off, man. And then that was just the last straw for you? Yeah. So you've got some self-respect, that. Eh? No. You don't? I don't have any hair left, no. Yeah, but I mean, you've got respect for yourself because you came here. You don't live in his garden anymore. Yeah. No I homo, bro. So. No homo. Just remember that. No, no homo. No homo. Of yeah. course not. I've also got my boundaries. Do you, do you want me to go further up? Yeah. How far up? Just like about like no, you can shave my night sack, it's fine. Okay. Can you take the pants off? Yeah, sure. I thought Danny was such a sensitive dude. <coughs> well he's really gentle yeah. um, when 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 you're like intimate with him. Okay. But otherwise you know, he just has a bad temper. You can get him rough. Yeah. The dominatrix. Yeah, he's he's just obsessed with dominating people. If you saw my video, he had my knee in my back. Like just submit, submit to daddy and just shaving my hair. Crazy.